Hi, Kate. Hey, Matt. Nice to see you. How's it going? Nice to see you. This is my girlfriend, Rose. Hi, Rose, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, finally. As a friend, I know how cheap she is, so I came to visit Kate to see her in action. I haven't seen Matt in over a year, and I have never met Rose. My first reaction when I walked in was, whoa, <laughs> this is really small and cluttered. Well, I'll show you around. OK. Not that there's a whole lot of space <laughs> to show, funny. but this is my makeshift couch. This mattress was from a, a dorm dumpster dive. Aren't you afraid it's got, like, stuff on it? Roaches on it. <laughs> but, I, you know, I do have the plastic bags over it, so, like, dust mites don't accumulate in there. That's nah, not something I would do, no. <laughs> this stool I also got off the street. So you don't pay for any furniture? No, I've never bought furniture before. This is the first time I got to see her being really cheap, so this was just completely like a shock. <laughs> this is another uh, shoe rack that I have that was um, I found off the curb. Well, this pair is the one that's um, 12 years old. I think it's time to get rid of those. <laughs> Where you do you don't, get like, the shoes? ever get new shoes? Yeah, actually, I do get new shoes regularly, and I usually look online and, uh, and watch for sales. So, yeah, and this is where, where I sleep. You sleep on this? Wow, that <laughs> doesn't seem comfortable at all. Actually, it is quite comfortable. This is a yoga mat. Yeah. From, like, a gym or something? Like, <laughs> yoga mats? Um, I think, um, yeah. I don't care what Matt and Rose say. They're not going to be my roommates or anything, so there's no need for me to buy a new bed just because Matt and Rose think it looks uncomfortable. Kate works really hard, and she doesn't spend money at all. And it's just very troubling <laughs> to me. How does this work? So yeah, this place came with a gas stove and oven. The utility company was charging me like um, a minimum monthly fee of 17 plus dollars. So I, I decided to shut off the gas. So then you use this instead? So, yep, yeah, that um, stove thing is what I use so too. It's like a Bunsen burner, because <laughs> it's only $17. It's only $17. It's just... It all adds up. Dying in here. Yeah, it's so, so really hot, hot in here. here. I don't know how you'd stand here in the summer. <laughs> you get sick just not having good circulation in here. I need to like step out for a second. <laughs> yeah, true. I'm like really dizzy. <laughs> I do not have air conditioning. I've heard of people with electric bills of a couple hundred dollars a month in the summer because they use air conditioning, so I do without them. OK? Yeah, I think so. I wouldn't purchase an AC just in order to have a guest coming over. This what? is the bathroom? Yep, this is the bathroom. That is very also tight. very small. Yes, it is. Your outfit's very interesting. Actually, these um, shorts I got um, maybe uh, 12 years ago, like when they were on sale. 12 years ago? So you've had them for a long time. Yeah, unfortunately, the elastic band on this, um, this pair of shorts wore out, so I have to use one of these blinder clips to clip them together so they don't uh, fall down. Normal people you should, don't usually go around with clips on their pants. I've been cooking up a surprise for you guys. Begin. I don't know. <laughs> doesn't look very appetizing. <laughs> it doesn't. What is it? Uh, these are some vegetables with uh, turkey and chicken and mashed potatoes. And this is a chicken fried rice. So everything's in the same pot? Like turkey? Yeah, this is a medley. Oh, OK. Go ahead, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> OK. Let's so try some of the turkey. Go ahead, Bruce. I guess I'll try a little bit of the turkey, too. Uh, I don't know if I want all the rest of this stuff with it. It's a little bit. What does it taste like? It doesn't really taste like turkey. It tastes like something like out of a can or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's turkey meatloaf. Oh. Can we eat any more of it? I'll or try are you some afraid? rice. Yeah, that's chicken fried rice. Grab up another spoon. <laughs> 
How's it taste? I don't know, it just doesn't seem fresh to me. <laughs> I'm gonna try a little bit of it. There's like chunks of stuff in here. Yeah. Some of it tasted okay, some of it tasted stale. You know, I might just stick to what I have. As a friend, I know how she lives. So I suspected the food came from the dumpster. You gonna try some of the uh, Do you have a knife to cut that? I have a big good idea. A portion of it. All right, we'll try a piece. <laughs> What's in the middle? Asparagus? Like asparagus. Yeah, asparagus. Where did you get this food from? It's a surprise. It's a surprise. <laughs> what does that chicken taste like? It just doesn't taste good to me. <laughs> so where did it come from? The trash <laughs> bags on the street. Oh. When I found out it came from the dumpster, I felt a little sick to my stomach. I'm just gonna go to the bathroom, if that's okay. Who knows what's in that dumpster? There's bugs and all sorts of stuff, especially in the city. Yeah, just, yeah. <laughs> I was trying to make it a surprise. I didn't tell them that um, I was going to feed them dumpster dive food. And I think that negatively affected their opinion. And here's some desserts. Oh, boy. <laughs> There's a knife. What is this one supposed to be? Looks like a chocolate. It's a chocolate cake. From the street. They look like they've been like messed with. See, like the tops all like dented in. I don't know. <laughs> chocolate cake too. There's like stuff coming off of it. Try a little bit of the chocolate cake, maybe. The icing doesn't taste fresh. Stale, huh? A little bit. Yeah. I don't want to get a water, if that's okay. Sure. <laughs> Why do you have newspaper on the racks? To keep my fridge clean. Oh. I often have dumpster dive food, and the packaging has is, comes dirty. I don't really see any water. The packaging being dirty is kind of, yeah, I don't really like that. <laughs> 